Hey, I'm Nadia. Welcome to Inline Warehouse. Today I'm going to talk to you about the Rossi's M12 Low Pomegranate Skates. So these are using the um, regular old M12 mold uh, that they've been using since 1996. So it's been a really popular mold and it's held its time. And um, it's also known as the Majestic 12 model because it's just a really great like classic kind of design that they've been using for so long. If you see low in the like title of the skate, it's usually referring to um, the cuff. So this one specifically has a slightly lower cuff um, than the regular M12. The black one probably sits around here and the original was way higher. Um, they are made really conservatively. They are made with um, recycled plastic in the polyurethane, and they are also made with 47% um, cornstarch base. So pretty good eco-friendly skate, and the liners are also eco-friendly. They are made with recycled lining and recycled padding inside. They have some nice little heel cups, and I thought they were nicer than um, regular like liners. They have a really strong strap in the back, and they have a nice neoprene toe that is really comfortable and makes it kind of more size adjustable. But I thought these were pretty good for a stock liner. The sole frame underneath they made in 2003, so it's kind of kept the same design, but it has these really nice grooves on the side that keep it kind of close to the foot, and it kind of goes underneath too, which is great. Um, a lot of people get really styly with these grinds, and you can tell that um, you have more stability because it's so close to your foot, but a complaint about it is that the sole plate isn't wide enough, so you can't really get into too many grinds this way, but um, but if you change the frames to a slightly thinner one, then you could get a little bit more grinding space. But the frames themselves are pretty slippery. They're made with polyamide and they are a UFS mount as well as a boot. So you can change them out to any other aggressive frame if you'd like. And the wheels on them are 58 millimeter, but there's only two and they have an 88.8 hardness. And then the inner wheels are the central grinding wheels. They don't move at all, which I thought was interesting. Usually you can feel like the bearings inside of there, um, but they have double-sided axles. And I feel like that'll kind of like help you with grinding if you kind of slip up into them. Um, overall, I would say this is a really great aggressive skate. Um, a lot of people would agree they've been making them for so long that they should be great at this point. Um, but yeah, Rosie's is a wonderful brand, and if you'd like to learn more about the skates or if you have any questions, please comment below and we'll be sure to help you. Have a great day.